Right, ladies, we're going to talk about one of David Elstob's specialities. He's got a big jewellery department. Oh, I know. Well, you've got the right market here, David. Wow. Who owns this one? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Any family stories behind this one? No. Did you buy it from any it, family? It was given to my mum to be given to me the day she was given it, not years later, straight away. All right. So whoever gave her it said, pass it to Susan. And so how long have you had it for? Uh, about 60 years. You uh, <laughs> never had it 60 years. <laughs> Yeah. Really? Yeah. Make, yeah. make some notes of these. I've got to write a book on this, David. <laughs> 60, you've had it seriously, for 60 years. Seriously, and yes. do you wear it? No. Why not? I need to ask you, is it safe to wear? Is it safe to wear? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's go and yeah. speak Generally. to him. Well, it certainly should be worn. Yeah. Um, um, very pretty. Um, I don't know any history of age-wise. Dates are probably 1900, 1910. It's Edwardian. Um, it's nine karat gold. Uh, it's got a couple of amethysts and some little seed pearls in there. It's a very typical piece of yeah. very kind of delicate Edwardian jewellery. I've got a few bits. You've got to remember the Victorian period, kind of jewellery was quite heavy. Mm -hmm. And then we go into the Edwardian period where it gets much simpler, more refined, quite delicate. Um, it's not a huge amount of value in it. So, I think you should be wearing it really. Um, there's collectors out there for pieces of Edwardian jewellery. It's in really nice condition. In an auction's probably 120, 150 pounds, something like that. Um, so definitely safe to wear. And would you ever sell it? <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Isn't it yeah, lovely how these things yeah. really form yeah. sentimental yeah, attachments absolutely. to you? Yeah. That's gorgeous. Well done. Round of applause for you. Thank you very much. Thank you.